Candlestick Point State Recreation Area was severely flooded by this winter's heavy rains. Hunters Point Expressway was flooded with foul-smelling water for months, and even after the water receded, the road was so damaged that it remains closed. Bikes and pedestrians cannot safely access the park because there is no sidewalk and no bike lane. We were so happy when the city intervened and worked with Five Point to pump out the standing water. They also worked to place K-Rail along Gilman Street so that pedestrians and bikes could safely access the park. As many challenges as this space has, uh, there's a lot of reason for hope. Uh, people with the leadership of the State Parks Foundation and State Parks and numerous other agencies and community leaders uh, are all coalescing together uh, to give Candlestick the love and attention that it needs. California State Parks Foundation has actually been doing what I think of as work of the heart. And they've been doing it for over 30 years. And here at Candlestick Point State Recreation Area, they brought the public's attention to this place. They've held public activities. State Parks Foundation has also raised money for other areas along the Bay shoreline here, have made incredible improvements as a partner of California State Parks. And also, they've advocated for other leaders, both at the local and state level, to come here and take a look at what the future could be here at Candlestick Point State Recreation Area.